A lot has happened since our last conference. The events of this past year have reshaped our world. It pushed companies to accelerate digital transformation of their customer's journey, as well as the supply chain of their own internal operations by three to four years. And the share of digital products in their portfolios has accelerated by a shocking seven years. Businesses all around are more digital today compared to where they were only 12 months ago. They need to build, deploy, and run real-time services in order to stay ahead of the curve. A real-time data layer is a critical enabler in building those real-time experiences. Redis Conf this year is going to be all about rediscovering real-time data, real-time apps, and real-time experiences that power a real-time world. Developers love Redis for its open source roots, but many still perceive it as an excellent caching system for accelerating other databases because the 10 to 100 millisecond response time of these other databases cannot guarantee a reasonable user experience. This never made sense to us. Why having a slow database with a caching system to support it when you can have a fast database that can respond in less than one millisecond under any transaction load? Modern apps need modern data models without losing performance. So we developed Redis to support, beside its original set of data structures, all modern data modeling technologies like JSON, time series, streaming data, and graph data, all complemented by a powerful indexing, query, and search engine. And in each such data model, Redis still provides a significant performance advantage over any other technology available today. We are seeing strong traction for this with Redis developers and with our customers. Redis modules adoption has grown 60% year over year in the last full fiscal year and 120% in the first two months of our current fiscal year compared to the same period a year before. By using Redis Bloom, Fiverr, a global marketplace that connects freelancers and businesses for digital services, improve their design and efficiency of their internal content catalog and significantly reduce developer onboarding time. And then by using Redis Search, Go Mechanic, a leading automotive services company in India, improved customer spare parts display, search, and SEO by more than four times. And by using Redis Time Series, SitePro, a utility metering solution provider, is able to offer real-time analytics done both on the edge and in the cloud with data gathered from hundreds of thousands of IoT sensors. Modern enterprise apps must be resilient and durable and are oftentimes globally distributed. We have reinforced Redis to become suitable for enterprise use by enabling as many as you want in-memory replications, adding an instant out of failover mechanism and enabling active-active gear distribution where you can read and write at a local speed in a database that is globally distributed. Active-Active is a big differentiator for companies like Vangel, Mutualink, and Coffee and Bagels, allowing them to run Redis with five nines availability and making it possible for them to deliver better business outcomes. 
Our active active adoption is on the rise and we have seen a 118% increase year over year. In today's modern era of digital transformation, cloud plays a major role. We are helping customers of all sizes across all verticals make the journey possible. As a result, Redis Enterprise for Cloud has been named alongside with Snowflake as the only challengers in the most recent Gartner Magic Quadrant for Cloud Databases. However, Redis was closer than Snowflake to the Leaders Quadrant, where you can find only tech giants like AWS, Microsoft, Google, and Oracle. All cloud providers offer fully managed Redis services based on open source Redis, and Redis Labs offers its Redis Enterprise Cloud service on all three major clouds. In the past, cloud providers monetized Redis without contributing much to it. But we are encouraged to see the growing interest and involvement of the major cloud providers in contributing to open source Redis and even more so partner with the company behind Redis. We appreciate having all three major cloud providers, AWS, Azure, and the Google Cloud as platinum sponsors at RedisConf this year. A year and a half ago, we partnered with the Google Cloud around offering Redis Enterprise as a native service on their platform. In RedisConf last year, we announced a partnership with Azure to offer Redis Enterprise Power Tiers on Azure Cache. This service became generally available in early March of this year. Recently, we also became an advanced technology partner of AWS, allowing AWS users to consume Redis Enterprise Cloud with their AWS commits. And I hope to share with you news about more partnerships with cloud providers in the foreseeable future. Shifting gears and driving attention to the world of machine learning and artificial intelligence, things like e-commerce recommendations, fraud detection, inventory management, claim processing, and others need a real-time platform. In the past, we announced Redis AI, which is an inference engine for serving data to ML-powered applications from where the data lives. However, we found that many ML-powered apps already use Redis to store ML features in what is called Feature Store, which is the bridge between the ML model and the data it uses. We think this is a natural evolution for Redis as the demand for online feature stores and for real-time decision-making engines grows. We now push on multiple fronts towards making Redis the de facto standard in this space, and we will share with you much more about this during these two days. Thank you.